Here's a pair of b Rives headphones, model number WH-22A. I'm gonna show you how to pair and connect these directly to a Hisense TV with Google TV via Bluetooth. First thing is let's put this in the pairing mode. If you look at the right ear cup here, you have three buttons on here, okay? That top button is the one, the button that we wanna use. It's the multifunction button or Bluetooth slash power button, okay? So let me just turn these headphones off first. Power button here, I'm gonna press and hold. Just keep holding. Okay, just said power off, okay? Now, what I'm gonna do to get this in pairing mode is I'm gonna press and hold that power button until the light starts blinking, blue, red, blue, red, blue, red, which would indicate that it's in pairing mode. So let's do it together. Let's put these in a pairing mode. Power button here. They're currently off. Hold the power button, ready, set, go. Press and hold. Power on, keep holding. It said pairing and it's blinking blue, red, blue, red, which indicates it's in pairing mode. So now we gotta go to the TV and you wanna go to the uh, your settings. If you don't have a settings button in your remote, you can just go to the home screen, click the, uh, the home button and top right hand side, the gear icon is the settings. So just go up and then you wanna move over to the right. Keep on going all the way over. So you get right there make sure the uh, the gear icon is highlighted right there. I'm going to click on OK on the remote. From here, I'm going to go down to remotes and accessories on the bottom here. Oh, there it is, remotes and accessories right there. Click on OK on the remote. Make sure Bluetooth is turned on and then we're going to go down to pair accessory. Click on OK. Oh, there we go. And now it's searching for devices that are in pairing mode that's near me, okay? The headphones are still in pairing mode, blue, red, blue, red. And what do you know? WH-22A. Make sure it's highlighted. Click on OK on the remote. It says pairing up there. Get a pairing request. Make sure pair is highlighted. Click on OK on the remote. It said pair and it said connect it down there and you can see the WH-22A right down there and it says it is connected. So we're ready to go. Once you're connected, the volume up and down should work. Oh, yep, there it is, volume right down there or you can decrease volume like that. We're connected, we're ready to go here. Now the thing is if you guys couldn't connect or you had pairing or connecting issues, you can always reset these as well. If you need to do that, look in the link in the description below.